Looking for keto recipes that are both low in fat and delicious? You've come to the right place. We're diving into the world of low-fat keto cooking, where flavor reigns supreme. This ain't your average greasy spoon, no siree. We're talking about clean, lean, and downright delectable dishes that'll have you wondering if you've died and gone to keto heaven. Over the next 10 recipes, I'm going to show you how to whip up some seriously tasty keto meals that are surprisingly low in fat. We're talking mouth-watering dishes that'll make you forget you're even on a diet. Get ready to ditch those cravings and embrace a healthier, happier you. Right you lot, let's kick things off with a classic chicken salad. But hold your horses, this ain't your grandma's chicken salad drowning in mayonnaise. We're going to make it lean, mean, and full of flavor. First, grab some cooked chicken breast. Make sure it's cooked to perfection, none of that rubbery nonsense. Now, dice it up into nice bite-sized pieces. Next, we need some crunch. Celery and red onion are our weapons of choice here. Chop them up finely. We don't want any chunky monkeys in this salad. Now for the secret weapon Greek yogurt. It's our creamy, dreamy substitute for the usual calorie bomb that is mayonnaise. Mix it all together with a squeeze of lemon juice, some Dijon mustard for a bit of a kick, and salt and pepper to taste. Serve it on a bed of lettuce, stuff it into some bell peppers, or just grab a spoon and dig in. It's that good. You can thank me later. Next up, we're ditching the pasta and embracing the wonderful world of zucchini noodles, or zoodles as the cool kids call them. Trust me on this one, they're an absolute game changer. Grab yourself a spiralizer and get to work on those zucchinis. Heat a pan over medium heat and saute them for just a couple of minutes, just until they're slightly tender. While the zoodles are working their magic, let's whip up a vibrant pesto sauce. We're talking fresh basil, pine nuts, garlic, parmesan cheese, the real deal, none of that jarred rubbish. Toss the zoodles in the pesto sauce, and you've got yourself a healthy, low-carb, and utterly delicious meal that's ready in minutes. You can even add some grilled chicken or shrimp for an extra protein punch. Stir fries are a godsend when you're short on time but still want a nutritious and flavorful meal. And guess what? They're easy to make keto-friendly with a little swap here and there. First things first, we need to ditch the rice. We're using cauliflower rice, the king of keto substitutes. You can either buy it pre-riced or blitz a head of cauliflower in a food processor until it resembles rice. Heat some olive oil in a large pan or wok over high heat. We want the pan screaming hot. Add your favorite stir-fry veggies, I'm talking broccoli, bell peppers, mushrooms, snap peas, the works. Stir-fry those veggies until they're crisp tender, then add your protein of choice. Chicken, tofu, prawns, the choice is yours. For a final flourish, drizzle over some soy sauce or tamari for that umami kick. And there you have it. A quick, easy, and healthy keto stir-fry that'll leave you feeling satisfied and energized. Enjoy your meal. Let's talk breakfast, the most important meal of the day. And what better way to start your day than with these protein-packed, low-fat, keto egg muffins? These little beauties are a meal prep dream and perfect for grabbing on the go. Whisk up some eggs in a bowl. I like to add a splash of milk or cream for extra richness. Now, here's where you can get really creative with your fillings. Diced veggies, crumbled bacon, shredded cheese, chopped herbs. The possibilities are endless. Pour the egg mixture into a greased muffin tin, sprinkle over your chosen fillings, and bake in a preheated oven until they're puffed up and golden brown. These egg muffins are a great way to get a healthy dose of protein and healthy fats in the morning, keeping you feeling full and satisfied until lunchtime. They're also great for freezing so you can always have a quick and easy breakfast on hand. Enjoy your morning boost. For a light and flavorful dinner that's both healthy and satisfying, look no further than this grilled salmon with asparagus. Salmon is a fantastic source of omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for brain and heart health. Start by preheating your grill or grill pan over medium heat. While the grill is heating up, prepare the salmon fillets by seasoning them with salt, pepper, and a squeeze of lemon juice. Trim the woody ends off the asparagus spears and toss them with a drizzle of olive oil, salt, and pepper. Place the salmon fillets and asparagus spears on the preheated grill. Grill the salmon for about four to five minutes per side, or until it's cooked through and flakes easily with a fork. Grill the asparagus for about five to seven minutes or until it's tender crisp. Serve it with a side of your favorite low-carb veggies, and you've got yourself a restaurant-quality meal that's ready in minutes. Enjoy your healthy dinner. Right, let's ditch those stodgy sandwiches and embrace the lightness of these keto turkey lettuce wraps. They're packed with flavor, low in carbs, and incredibly satisfying. First, we need to cook up some ground turkey. Brown it in a skillet over medium heat, breaking it up with a wooden spoon as it cooks. While the turkey is browning, chop up some veggies for added crunch and flavor. 
I like to use red onion, bell peppers, and water chestnuts. Once the turkey is cooked through, drain any excess grease and return it to the skillet. Add your chopped veggies and stir fry for a couple of minutes or until the veggies are slightly softened. Now, for the sauce. I like to use a simple mixture of soy sauce or tamari, rice vinegar, and a touch of sesame oil for that authentic Asian flavor. Spoon the turkey mixture into large lettuce leaves. Butter lettuce or romaine lettuce work best. Top with your favorite garnishes. Chopped cilantro, sliced green onions, and a sprinkle of sesame seeds are always a winner. These lettuce wraps are a delicious and healthy way to enjoy a flavor-packed meal without the guilt. Enjoy your light and tasty meal. Who says you can't have a delicious and satisfying smoothie on a keto diet? This low-fat keto smoothie will blow your mind. It's creamy, dreamy, and packed with healthy fats and nutrients. The key to a good keto smoothie is to keep it low in carbs and high in healthy fats. Start with a base of unsweetened almond milk or coconut milk. Add a handful of leafy greens like spinach or kale. You won't even taste them, I promise. For a boost of healthy fats and creaminess, add a dollop of almond butter or peanut butter. Just make sure it's the natural kind without any added sugar. A tablespoon of chia seeds or flax seeds will add extra fiber and omega-3 fatty acids. Blitz everything together in a blender until smooth and creamy. This smoothie is the perfect way to start your day or refuel after a workout. Stuffed peppers are a classic comfort food, and they're surprisingly easy to make keto-friendly. These keto stuffed peppers are hearty, flavorful, and perfect for a satisfying weeknight meal. Start by preheating your oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit or 190 degrees Celsius. While the oven is heating up, prepare the bell peppers. Slice the peppers in half lengthwise and remove the seeds and membranes. Arrange the pepper halves in a baking dish. Now let's make the filling. Brown some ground beef or turkey in a skillet over medium heat. Drain any excess grease and return the meat to the skillet. Add chopped onion, garlic, and your favorite keto-friendly veggies. I like to use diced tomatoes, zucchini, and mushrooms. For a flavor boost, stir in some tomato paste, Italian seasoning, and a pinch of red pepper flakes. Spoon the filling into the prepared pepper halves and bake in the preheated oven for 20 to 25 minutes or until the peppers are tender and the filling is heated through. Sprinkle with shredded cheddar cheese during the last few minutes of baking for a gooey, cheesy finish. Enjoy your hearty meal. Avocado toast, the millennial breakfast staple, can also be enjoyed on a keto diet. This low-fat keto avocado toast is a delicious and satisfying way to start your day or enjoy a light lunch. Now here's the twist. We're ditching the bread. I know, I know it sounds sacrilegious, but trust me on this one. We're using sliced cucumbers as our base. They're crunchy, refreshing, and low in carbs. Slice a cucumber into thick rounds. These will be our toast slices. Now for the star of the show, the avocado. Have an avocado and remove the pit. Scoop out the avocado flesh and mash it in a bowl with a fork. Season with salt, pepper, and a squeeze of lime juice. Spread the mashed avocado evenly over the cucumber slices. Now here's where you can get creative with your toppings. I like to keep it simple with a sprinkle of everything bagel seasoning for a bit of a kick. Other great options include sliced cherry tomatoes, red pepper flakes, or a drizzle of hot sauce. This avocado toast is a refreshing and satisfying way to enjoy a keto-friendly meal. Perfect for breakfast or a light lunch. Enjoy your creative toast. There's nothing quite as comforting as a warm bowl of soup, and this keto chicken soup is no exception. It's packed with flavor, low in carbs, and perfect for a cozy night in. Start by heating some olive oil in a large pot or Dutch oven over medium heat. Add chopped onion, celery, and carrots to the pot and cook until softened, about 5 to 7 minutes. Add minced garlic to the pot and cook for another minute or until fragrant. Pour chicken broth into the pot along with shredded cooked chicken breast. Bring the soup to a boil, then reduce heat and simmer for 15 to 20 minutes or until the flavors have melded. Stir in chopped kale or spinach during the last few minutes of cooking. For a creamy, indulgent twist, stir in a dollop of heavy cream or coconut milk before serving. Season with salt, pepper, and your favorite herbs and spices. This keto chicken soup is the perfect meal for a cold winter's day or when you're feeling under the weather. There you have it, you lot. 10 low-fat keto recipes that are guaranteed to tantalize your taste buds and leave you feeling satisfied. From light and refreshing salads to hearty and comforting soups, there's something for everyone. Now what are you waiting for? Get in the kitchen and start cooking. Don't forget to subscribe to VB9 for more incredible keto cooking videos and share your culinary creations with me in the comments below. Let me know what keto recipes you want to see next. I'm always up for a challenge. Remember, eating healthy doesn't have to be boring. 
Now go forth and conquer those cravings.